Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I think we have a all of that too. Okay. Excellent. Well, we're talking, we, I didn't realize this, but the startup weekend, this weekend, it's all your meals are included in this thing? Yep, all your oh, yeah. meals, all your snacks. We're giving people notebooks and little bags, and we've got these really cool, like, logos on them and water bottles, and it's going to be fun. But all your meals, free food, right, Joey? Yeah. Right? <laughs> what? I mean, we saw the required That's a good ones. business uh, pitch right? right there. Right. Yeah, the free food. <laughs> free servers. That's, yeah. I'm in. I am totally in. The Startup Team Weekend is this weekend it's at this Fat weekend. Pipe. And this is a chance for any kid, anybody from basically, can it be like a 12 year old or 11 year old? Doesn't have to be a teenager. 12 year olds, we're welcome to as long as they're willing to work and ready to, to go. To 19 year olds. Yep. And you can go to the Fat Pipe this weekend and you can learn how to basically start a business, find a team, and launch a business as a teenager, which sounds just like so much fun. And it's 39 bucks to register, am I right? Yes. But because we're the morning brew, we have a promo code. Nice. Right. So what's nice. the promo code? The promo code is Morning Brew, one word, all caps, and it's for ten dollars off. So. So nice. twenty nine bucks. Yeah. You get seven meals and learn how to launch a business, and you you can get to this by, on your Facebook page, which is Facebook is a teen startup. We have a startup teen Facebook page, and then we also have a teen startup weekend Albuquerque Facebook page, and we also have tons of scholarships still available. So if you can't afford that, just send us an email, do the little scholarship application, and we'll hook you up. Awesome. And how many Team Startup Weekends are there in the world? Is this like the only one um, or are there more of these? So our last event in November was the first one, the first Team Startup Weekend in the world. So that was pretty cool. And I know there have been a couple more since us. And then we're doing a second one here in Albuquerque. And we also had like a teen startup day in Santa Fe that I actually helped coach a little bit for. So oh, we definitely cool. know that you know the teenage entrepreneurial world is definitely getting a lot more lift around uh, the world. Very you cool. Give, you guys are giving uh, uh, teenagers like a really great experience here, and especially if they're you're getting a leg up for getting into college or getting degrees like this. Where where I was just told to find something trendy and latch on was my, and I don't think that's necessarily the right way to go. You, you so, found Star like Wars and doing. you stayed with it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, yeah, no, there was a thing. Was when we were growing up, that's I mean, awesome. find a company and work for it. It was yeah. kind of the, you know, or Sandia Labs or something along those lines. Right. But now the, the opportunities are there, and also the push is there to find, and even you don't have to be a teenager to start a business, right. but the start is, the, it's really intro, introducing teenagers now to it so that when, yeah, you do get out of college, or when something happens, you can start a business. You know? Well, I yeah. think a great motto is to find what you enjoy and exactly. then find a way to get paid for it. No doubt. No <laughs> doubt. Well, that's what you've done your whole life, it sounds Absolutely. like. Absolutely. It sounds like it. And we can find all the information about ghosts at, at ox.com. This is the last weekend. It's Friday and Saturday at 8, and then there's a Sunday matinee at 2 p.m. Um, tickets are $15, and if you go online and get your tickets, you can get them for 12 and students with a valid ID are ten dollars. Awesome. So this is a show all about people's secrets. That's right. So Joey, what's your biggest secret? Um, <laughs> yeah. Just, <laughs> I'll put it on Twitter. Okay. Yeah, really and you can profile. find jo you can find Joey on yeah. Twitter. Just at Joey Belleville. That's right. And, and you can, if you don't like his movie recommendations, if you think there's another version of the Machete. Yeah. You can just at at Joey Belleville. You can on send Twitter. all. Any kind of hate tweets, that's no problem. I'll forward it straight to the Omaha. Omaha Nicely baseball done. Team. <laughs> Nicely awesome. done. Be awesome. The, um, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to try to figure out if there's another version of the Machete thing for, for yeah, watching Star people, Wars. Some people mess around with different orders, you know. Uh, uh, the Machete method is, is the only one that's chopping one out. Right. And so I, I thought it was really, really cool. And I tried it, and it worked. I just got to so figure out awesome. a way to get. Danny Trejo in a Star Wars film. I think we need to start, you know, a fan yes. petition to get Danny Trejo to be the next Star Wars character. <laughs> I think he'd be like the best bounty hunter ever. That would be amazing. Right? That would be amazing. I'm so stoked for the movie. I can't understand <laughs> it. Well, it's here at the Boarding Brew, you guys have all your awesome Facebook pages and web websites and everything. We have ours, too. And you can find us on Morning, at Morning Brew on YouTube. Uh, we're on Facebook also, just Morning Brew Show. And tweet at us, at my, at my Morning Brew. And you can find out everything about what we're doing. You can also find clips of all the shows. And then we have an awesome new website, which is Morning Brew, the Morning Brew. Dot TV, where there's awesome pictures of me, and you can get clips there, <laughs> and links to all of our sponsors too, and events, and everything. I think we're gonna be 
really eager on Monday morning, though, to see who wins at the Oscars. At least mm -hmm. I am. Maybe we're just movie nerds about this stuff. It could be. I, I'm like you. I, I really want to try to see all of the Best Picture nominees, yeah. but I just didn't. I wasn't able to pull that off this year. Well, there were nine this year. Yeah. Well, yeah, there's always an insane amount, and right. then they're all in all the other categories, too. Right. Same, you know, same all six, seven movies. From September on. Right. Yeah, yeah you don't have... I, I haven't had then, nine free weekends in yeah. September to watch all these <laughs> movies. It's not been in the theater. So. Right. That's exactly... Or also the $9,000 I would spend on popcorn <laughs> to do all of that. The uh, But we'll, see, we'll be anxious to see who wins that. But we got a great show coming up Monday with uh, Greg Frost Sr. is going to be here. Our buddy Steve... <laughs> in the curious town he's going to bring some special guests we got more startup stuff too the women's startup weekend folks are going to be here on monday Sweet. and they're so it's going to be like startup after startup it's going to be so much fun and yeah we got a whole bunch more uh, on the morning brew with friends we'll see you next week